experience with the Builders Boot Camp has been excellent. And as a contractor and a builder and someone who's very interested in energy efficient construction, their information and contacts are valuable. I've been looking forward to this for a year and I finally got here. I'm excited. <laughs> My experience was great. I got to sit in on some sessions that taught me a few things that I didn't know previously and was able to delve into some areas that in other training sessions only touched lightly on. So that was pretty cool. I'm Rick Karg, RJ Karg Associates and Residential Energy Dynamics from the state of Maine. What I liked about the Builders Boot Camp was the interactivity. It set up an opportunity to have a lot of interaction with the builders that were here, the low-income weatherization people that were here. A lot of hands-on, a lot of questions. I probably learned as much as they did. I think the thing that I find really helpful is just the, the expertise of the presenters. They really know their subject matter. I really like the hands-on part of the testing and everything because that's something I've never done. I've picked up a lot of different techniques to do what we do on our jobs, different ways that are probably going to save us some money. The exposure to um, the energy efficiency models, whether it was new construction, remodeling, or within the weatherization programs, the retrofitting, that it seemed that the new energy codes and best practices were being touched on regardless of what projects we were involved in. It's getting to meet people from all around who are doing you know, different kinds of work. We're asking a lot more of our buildings and we're not necessarily asking more of our building professionals. Organizations like Community Housing Partners and Boot Camp, they raise the bar and the bar has to go up because it's not fair to ask the buildings more if we're not going to do more. We're currently venturing out into private jobs and we weren't aware of the code, so now it's helping us out a lot. I would strongly encourage a repeat of the Builders Boot Camp, not only for local builders and low-income motorization folks, but also on a national level.